Hi, my name is Christoph. I would like to welcome you all back to our channel. Now, if this is new for you, don't forget to hit the bell and subscribe button and you will be notified as soon as we've got a new video coming out. Today, I'm gonna talk to you about uh, the prop effect. You probably have seen uh, that if you've put the boat in reverse, if you've already been driving a boat, that it's not completely listening and doing what you wanna do. And that's because of the form of the prop. A prop is made to go forward. It also works in reverse, of course, uh, but it's a bit against the form that's been created. And uh, that's why it's like, like um, a wheel spinning in a direction and it's actually taking the boat in one direction. All right, let me show it to you. We're going forward with our boat and let's have a look on the back end because that's basically where we see the most. My boat is moving forward, yeah. Now, Let's pull it in neutral and then in reverse. You see the engine is still straight. I'll pull it in reverse. And as soon as I see it in reverse, have look at the horizon as well. See my boat is not going straight anymore. I will point it as well to the nose. And let's get back to the nose. Up. Now you see the boat has been twisted around a little bit. So what's actually happening, my prop in reverse is turning that way and it's pulling the whole boat and in that direction. And that's actually what the prop effect does. It all depends a bit on uh, the type of boat you're driving and the rotation of the engine, uh, the type of uh, props you've got on, if it's a big one, a small one, how, how, uh, how big the effect it's gonna be. And it also points out that if you're fiddling around a bit by going forward, backwards, neutral all the time, you're making your life probably much difficult in the harbor so that's what we teach in practical courses as well all right but basically that's it that's what the problem fact is about 